Hey guys! Oh my god, I look really rough. Welcome back to our channel. In case you are new, my name is Jasmine. I film couples videos as well as family videos with my now fiance, Daniel. I'm currently, I don't know if you can see, 36 weeks pregnant. So we've been posting a lot of pregnancy content lately because, well, I'm pregnant. <laughs> And so that is one of one of those videos. It's gonna be one of those videos today, kinda. I don't know. Like right now, I guess it's just like a a pregnancy update vlog. I guess. Daniel just left for work. I just woke up from a very good nap, as you can tell by my nap hair, my bed head. I just woke up from a good old nap. It's pretty late. I'm gonna be honest with you. It is. <sighs> It is 6 in the evening, so starting off this vlog a little late. And it is also Halloween. Let me add that. It is Halloween. Saturday night in the Coles household. We're partying it up. So basically, I thought I would vlog what I do when Daniel goes to work. Or in this case, what I am going to do today. So... Like I mentioned earlier, just woke up from a nap, baby girl's moving, and I'm a feel... Hi, Junior. I have a feeling <coughs> she's hungry, so I'm gonna get, get her a little snack. What's on the to-do list for today? I am going to kind of set up my hospital bag. Ooh! Like, um, try to figure out everything I'm gonna put in it. And I'm also gonna do a separate video of that once I have it completely done, just to show you guys what I'm bringing to the hospital to deliver this baby girl during this whole pandemic. I think, well, I don't know. How do y'all feel about Christmas? <laughs> like, is it too early to start decorating? Because I'm gonna start decorating today. Like, I'm gonna put up lights. Daniel and I just bought a Christmas tree so we can set it up on my birthday. Cause my birthday's coming up in two weeks, so I'm excited. Well, let's see what comes first, my birthday or Lorena. That's our baby girl's name, if y'all didn't know. Anyways, so I'm gonna also do that today. I'm gonna set up some tree lights. Not tree light, I'm gonna set up some lights around the apartment. Oh, as well, I'm gonna do a little DIY maternity, I mean pregnancy costume <laughs> later tonight. Just so Daniel and I can have a picture to post tomorrow, I guess, for like Halloween. Even though we're not doing anything or going anywhere, but. Look at my 
my big old belly. I wrote myself, oh, look at my stretch marks. I'm so busy. My stomach, I didn't think I was gonna get stretch marks, but I'm starting to get a little bit of stretch marks on my belly. I don't know if you could see that. Right here, it used to be my belly button ring. Oh, poor Junior, he hates the boots. Anyways, I wrote myself a checklist of all the things I'm bringing in my hospital bag. I'll show you that right now. It's okay, papacito. I got pretty much all the clothing set up. Now I'm about to do the toiletries, but look how full it is. I know I don't need all this stuff, but I don't know. I'm bringing it all just in case. Okay, you guys, I'm taking a break from doing my hospital bag so I can cook. over the place so I just finished cookie cooking like not even dinner a late dinner for Daniel and I to eat once he gets home and he just told me right now that they're cleaning so he should be home in like 20 minutes but I figured since um, it is Halloween Daniel and I would take some like Halloween 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 inspired maternity pictures for fun, I guess. And I figured while I'm doing this, I would do a um, pregnancy Q&A. So, as I am doing my makeup, I will be answering questions that I've had people ask me via Instagram and Facebook. So let me go ahead and answer my first question. Let me go to Instagram first. First is, I guess it's famous, is I just wanna say Lorena it's gonna be a pretty baby. Oh, that's cute, that's so nice. Next question, who helped you out throughout this time? My biggest supporter, of course, is Daniel. He gives me massages, he's very understanding of the pregnancy. He never complains, even if I'm, you know, I can be dramatic sometimes. And he never bites back at me, he's very, Daniel's one of those very understanding people. He's just a really good guy. And so he has been so strong and so understand, understanding and caring throughout this whole process. I couldn't have asked for a better partner. And I'd say my family is another big supporter, like my mom and my sisters. They definitely help me out a lot. So just my family. And my friend Amber, I really appreciate her. She's one that actually like um she asked about my pregnancy a lot, sees how I'm doing, as well as Camila. Shout out to you too, girl. You know, one of the few people that actually checks up on me to see how I'm doing and just even if it's so like Camila, if I post a picture of my belly, she'll like just ask use that as a way to ask me how I'm doing and I really appreciate it because you know it gets lonely especially during the coronavirus like you don't go out you can't see anyone and it's just it was it's really nice of them next question are you ready well I don't think this is something you can be necessarily ready for it's just what I've been doing is just trying to prepare as much as possible and I know this sounds so silly, but TikTok has been really good source for all like a bunch of pregnancy stuff. Like a bunch of baby and newborn stuff. There's a lot of moms out there that are, post a lot of TikToks that are really helpful, honestly. So I'm gonna say TikTok really helps out to make me feel ready. All right, while I let my concealer set a little bit, I'll answer another question. Are you sad it's almost over? Um, mm, I mean, I'm not super sad because I'm more excited to meet Lorena. I'm so excited to meet her. And so I think that overshadows um, being sad of not being pregnant anymore. So I, I'm pretty sure I will be sad whenever I'm no longer pregnant. But right now, like, 
I'm not like I'm not super sad not as of this moment what changes have you made I have to sneeze Sorry. What changes have you made in your life? Um, not much. <laughs> because before my pregnancy, I was just got out of a job looking for a job. And then I found out I was pregnant. So not much has really changed. Except the fact that I'm just getting bigger. I've always been nauseous. I've always had these like, you know. I just, nothing really has changed. No, nothing. Just the fact that I'm getting bigger and preparing for a baby. That's it. Um, I feel, I guess I feel like I have a uh, more space in my heart to love something. Like I'm, my heart is opening up to loving someone else, you know, someone very special. My baby girl, like she's now became my entire life. I guess, well, I guess that does mean my life has changed completely because she like anytime I think of doing anything I think of her as a priority so I guess that's how my life has changed like anytime I'm gonna do anything I refer to her like how will this affect her like is this good for her like I don't really like me and Daniel are second to her when it comes to all life choices. All of them. Alrighty, before I move on to the eyes, I guess I will answer another question. How do you feel? Well, I don't know what you mean by that question. Seems like a very general question. Like, how do I feel right now? Or how do I feel about the pregnancy? Or how do I feel about my due date coming up so soon? I guess to answer how I feel right now, as of this moment, I feel excited. I'm just super excited to meet our baby girl. So excited and I feel so blessed to have the opportunity to raise a baby girl. You know, not a lot of people get that opportunity. Not a lot of people get to feel that type of love. You know, like I already feel so much love for her. I can't even imagine when I see actually am able to see her feel her touch her hold her like I just I am I just feel overwhelmed I just feel filled with love that's how I feel I feel filled with so much love and I can't wait to be able to give it to her you know I can't wait to I just I'm so excited like I saw a video of a baby <laughs> This morning and I just start bursting into tears I'm like it's gonna be so surreal to be able to feel her to be able to hold her like sometimes it doesn't even feel real cuz I'm like you see she's moving right now she's reacting to what I'm saying um, like it's just crazy the fact that I'm giving the opportunity to love someone so deeply like I love her already and I just can't wait to show her the world, give her the world. I can't wait for her to change me, to show me how to live life. You know, I'm just so excited for everything. Okay, I think that's it for this part of the Q&A. Because the video is already getting long enough. So, I'm just going to finish my makeup off camera. But next time you see me is going to be with Daniel. Okay, you guys. Just finish my makeup. I just need to add lipstick and I should be Gucci. But I really like how it turned out. Guess who's home? And he's already making my thing look even better. Good what change. should I drink tonight, guys? Oh yeah, I tonight. I have not drank in for the longest. And maybe like a year, honestly, right? Probably. No. Well, like nine months. <laughs> more like, probably like, like, Five, six months because of the last time I drank it was what? Quince? Oh, yeah. Had, uh, micheladas when I really oh, did yeah. So, so, like, probably five months. So, well, I don't know what to drink. Probably I'm gonna, since I haven't drank in a while, probably I'm gonna drink wine. But I don't know. Dinner. Wine, 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 wine. <laughs> Food is served. Show them which one you chose. 
I end up choosing wine. Well, I said I was gonna drink wine. <coughs> but which one? I chose uh, Uno, Uno. Uh, Red Blend, and Tigo. From Argentina. Mm. So, I think I'm gonna be painting my baby's belly. So, I'm gonna be doing a soccer ball on her belly, I think. Well, I'm gonna make her belly look like a soccer ball. Like this. Like that. Okay, ready.